girls basketball playoffs get into full swing this week with regional semifinals kicking things off. A rivalry game to start the postseason. Hananiga and Harlem facing off in McChesney Park. Maya Davidson making the strong move. That gives Harlem a 10-point lead in the second quarter. But here comes Hananiga. Allison Needfelt pushing the pace. Nice move to finish high off the glass. Then Haley Warren with the hot hand. She gets to the top of the key and knocks it down. And how about another three ball from Haley. It's Hananiga up 33-31 at the half. Beth Meyer coaching up her Huskies, but in the second half, the Lady Indians keep it going. Carly LeMay drives and scores. They go on a 23-2 run between the second and third quarters. LeMay so in control, calmly hits over two defenders. 20 points for the senior, and then Warren, hot hand Haley with 24 points. Hananiga wins at 68-52 to punch a ticket to the regional final. In the other semifinal at Harlem, Auburn taking on DeKalb. Tie game at the half, but in the second half, Brooklyn Gray drives and kicks to Nala Taylor for the three, and she hits nothing but net. Zakyla Evans gets to the lane, hits the little floater. DeKalb, though, had Amina Gray going. So tough, she comes off the screen and hits for three. She had 25 points. Dalton Miller keeping the Lady Knights focused. And how about Brooklyn Gray facilitating again that slick pass. Give her the hockey assist as the Knights kick it out to Ty Rogers for three. And Brooklyn Gray getting plenty of her own buckets as well. 25 points on 11 of 15 shooting. Auburn wins 68-49, setting up a showdown with Hananiga for the regional title. Guilford taking on Hampshire in the Jefferson Regional Semis. Lindsey Knuth gets the feed from Kiara Brandon, and she knocks down the jumper. Good look there from Brandon. Hampshire fights back as Avery Cardi drives and draws the foul, gets it to go. Mike Jamerson, though, coaching up the Lady Vikes. Brandon taking over the RVC bound shooter, knocks down the three, then shortly after, it's going to hit another one as Guilford gets the win. They stay alive. 58 45. They'll play Huntley for the regional title on Thursday.